the Sturm Tiger, a behemoth of a unit, the OKW in Company Heroes 2. It absolutely flattens buildings, destroys complete blobs, and if given the chance, will absolutely demolish tanks. Hey guys, Helping Hands here, and welcome to this video. Well, I'll tell you how to build an unlimited number of Sturm Seekers by using this awesome trick. But first, let's get into the basics. So, how do we get a Sturm Seek on the field in the first place? So, you need your battle group headquarters or your mechanized setup, and then get your Schwer upgraded, and then that allows you then to call on the Sturm Seeker for 570 manpower and 165 fuel. Once you, you click on the icon, and then you left click where you want the, the vehicle to call in, and you can see here comes the Sturm Seeker onto the battlefield. Now, you. You can't build any more than one Sturm Tiger as the game limits you to only one. However, if the Sturm Tiger becomes abandoned, you could then call in on another one and then recruit the abandoned one to actually have two on the battlefield, for instance. Okay? And I'll show you how to do that. So, a lot of you guys already know that when you fire a Sturm Tiger and then it reloads, while it's reloading, it is very vulnerable. And any enemy vehicle generally that hits it and penetrates it will then make the vehicle become abandoned. Okay? So, in that regard, trying to reload your Sturm Tiger on the front line is a bad idea. As it will likely become abandoned if you get shot up by enemy vehicles. And then it'll be hard to recover and possibly your opponents will steal it. Now, to get multiple Sturm Tigers, you want to be able to abandon your Sturm Tiger somewhere nice and safe. Preferably your base. And you can do this by following this tip. So, I tested this out with multiple access vehicles to see which one would be the most reliable and the fastest at putting the Sturm Tiger in an abandoned state. And that was the Flak Half Jack. In this video, you will now see four Flak Half Jacks fire on four Sturm Tigers as they are trying to reload. And you'll see here how effective they are at, at doing that job. So, as you can see here, it is fairly reliable, not 100% reliable, as you can see that two of the four flat half tracks are having difficulty there trying to degrew the Sturm Tiger. But, with perseverance, they will do this. Um, it shouldn't take too long, as I've done multiple tests. And uh, so how, with this knowledge, how do we utilise this to get lots and lots of Sturm Tigers for our entire team? What do we do? So, to start doing this, obviously you need the Sturm Tiger and a flat half track. You also need a decent fair bank of resources as this strategy is going to rely on you spending a lot of manpower and a lot of fuel on Sturm Tigers uh, that aren't going to be under your control mostly as you're going to be giving them to your teammates. So hopefully you've got your teammates are, are doing well and have some good control of the battlefield and you can rely on them for everything else. So what you want to do here is you want to first fire off your Sturm Tiger off one round like so. Get your flak after sitting up behind it. Press Z and then get the Black half to attack around the center of the vehicle. And then you just got to wait until it happens. It could be really quickly or it could take a few minutes, depending. But generally, in my test that I've done, it's no more than um, maybe one or two minutes. Maybe it takes a second reload attempt, but you'll see here that the Black half will eventually abandon this. Shortly, like that. There we go. Perfect. And obviously, we want to stop holding. You want to stop firing and now we can call on another Sturm Tiger but it should take maybe three minutes for us to call it in um, but then your teammate you, then your teammate can come up recruit that and off you go and he can use the Sturm Tiger if he's an OKW player he should be able to get up to version C5 if he's an Austere player he should only get up to version C3 um, however it's still very handy to have uh, and then you just can keep calling another Sturm Tiger on if you wanted let's say for instance you wanted um, I don't know three Sturm Tigers for yourself which is unlikely you'll ever be able to do that, but to do that, all you need to do is just make sure is to keep the Sturm Tiger in an abandoned state on the battlefield. There we go. And then another Sturm Tiger we can call on. Boom. And then, once we, once that, then we, if you just want it, then we can recruit these. Like so. And then, there you go. You'd have to reload them again once they become abandoned. But, there you go, we have three Sturm Tigers now, right? Awesome. And this will definitely catch your opponent by surprise. No one ever expects this many Sturm Tigers on, on the field. 
So there you guys go. That was really easy to do. All you need is a Sturm Tiger, a flat half track, maybe some Sturm Pioneers nearby to repair any damage that's done to the vehicle. Uh, as it is a flat half track that's firing on the Sturm Tiger, it won't, you know, you know, hardly ever have any problems with with getting actually blowing up the vehicle because it does hardly any damage to it. But it just does that, just a bit enough damage that will get the damage that will um, in, uh, disable. Um, the, we'll get the crew to jump out and uh, the vehicle to become an, in an abandoned state. Another vehicle I tried this with which had some success was the Panzer II. And the reason why is because there's just a lot of rounds firing, right? You can see in one big, big burst it does maybe like 10 rounds in that, in that big clip, right? And the Panzer II also has a lot of rounds when it fires. So the more rounds that are firing, the more chance you're going to get um, to uh, potentially abandon the vehicle. Um, unlike something like if you had a Panther or, or a Panzer IV, they're, they're, you know, they only fire one shot at a time, it's going to be very, very slow. So you want something with rapid fire, they can fire a lot, do a lot of rounds in, in a short area, and you're hoping that one of those rounds will, will get that abandoned state critical. And also would recruit the Sturm Tigers with like something cheap like Volkswagen is, not your Sturm Pioneers, as you want to save yourself uh, manpower. Uh, it's also worth noting, though, that Sturm Tigers are expensive population cap, 18 population cap, so wouldn't want to make too many of them. But if you want to go for a meme, you can do this. I'm probably going to do this in my next, one of my new, uh, upcoming 4v4 videos now that I've uh, figured this out. But yeah, hope you guys enjoyed this and uh, enjoy using Sturm, multiple Sturm Tigers in your upcoming games. Hi, right, lads. Thanks for watching that video. If you want more content, click up here. Or click over here to click on other content. But make sure to click on that middle button to subscribe to the channel. Okay. And I uh, stream every single day on twitch.tv forward slash helping hands. Catch you in the next one, guys. Take care.